Okay, um, to start off, the Waltz and Such Vintage Social Dancers will perform the Romani Polka, choreographed in period style by Richard Powers, to a fun piece called Romani Life, which is music from the 19th century opera by Victor Herbert. and improvisation includes most of the social dances common in the United States between the early 19th century and the latter half of the 20th century. One of the many dances that became popular in America during the ragtime era was the tango, which was imported to New York from Argentina about 1913. We will demonstrate early American tango with a choreography Joan Walton wrote in period style to music titled A Media Luz a pleasant and satisfying tango piece that was published in 1924. Uh, hopefully you found these historical details interesting, uh, but frankly we actually just needed to take up enough time for the ladies to get rid of their 19th century paraphernalia. Um, doing a tango in a hoop skirt is really hard. Um, the guys on the other hand have it easy. They actually could have kept their tailcoats, but you know, as long as the ladies need to change anyway, we thought we'd give a nod to the South American origins of the tango.
Since we call ourselves Waltz and Such, it seems fitting that we actually include a waltz right about now. Uh, we will dance to six verses of a song entitled That Sultry Waltz. The steps are based on a rotary waltz mixer written for it and called with astonishing originality That Sultry Waltz Mixer. We hope to teach you the basic steps of That Sultry Waltz Mixer. And if you pay attention, you'll see those steps in verse 3 and then again with a modest variation in verse 4. And in verse 5, we will demonstrate something called waltz swing, which you may well have never seen before. Finally, verse 6 provides an example of some embellishments that can be incorporated within the framework of the basic sultry waltz mixer. If you come to our classes at 7.15 p.m. on Fridays in room 207 of the Casa del Prado, um, you can learn things like these more challenging variations. Thank you very much. Um, we'd like to ask the audience to participate now. Um, each